everything is so overgrown and we're in the middle of nowhere right now. It's insane. And, and dude, the, the 13th Ghost movie was exactly like yeah, that. Yeah, just looks just like this. Right? Yeah, exactly That's like this. That's what I it. saw everybody saying. Dude, come here now. What the hell? Bro, they did like find a body here. I'm not even joking. So that could probably be a reason this, why it's abandoned. Do you see a body in there? Oh my god. What the hell? Before we begin the video, I just want to give a special shout out to our newest Patreon supporter, Mary Mendoza. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. If you wish to also support the channel, definitely head over to the Patreon page, link in description. Yo, what's going on you guys? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new around here, my name is Steve Ronan and we go on the best explorations every single week. You know, subscribe, hit the notification button bell. Today, I'm also joined here with Kyle McGrand. What's up? And we got Colin right here. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. We both got YouTube channels. Link down below in the description. Hey. And yes, um, throughout this whole weekend, I'll be exploring with them. <laughs> no, no, I saw Kyle. Yeah, I saw no, Kyle. Long time, long time. I heard some, so I looked at the uh, house, and everyone your panicked. Your face looks scared for a moment. I'm like, <laughs> no, everyone's panicking. All anyway, right. yeah. So uh, we found this place in the middle of nowhere. Literally, this it abandoned mansion. It took forever too to it find it. If you mentioned that, like, oh my I'll show God. you guys around, like how the area looks. But everything is so overgrown. Um, this place is super, super rare, you guys. We did so much research to try to find this place. We had to like look at the satellite maps, and it <laughs> oh took God. us like a couple days to find. Um, but we found it here, and yeah, we. I can't wait to show you guys how this place looks. It's like out of a movie, almost like the Thirteenth Ghost. If you have seen that, it's like oh, yeah, a that's what, yeah, that's what yeah. Thirteenth Ghost. Um, this this whole entire mansion is made of glass. That's the most unique thing about it. But there's other cool things that we'll be seeing around, like the architecture, the, the woodwork. So we're gonna be documenting this place with this video and photos as well. So I hope you guys do enjoy it. It's like quite a mystery. Yeah. There's like it doesn't have an address. Um, you can hardly find it on Google Maps because on the on the on the rooftop, it's also like made of grass. Like they try to camouflage yeah. it almost. Yeah. They try to keep it I really hidden. About that, yeah, it is. Like you can see it right there. And I, I wonder why. There's so many rumors. Like this place used to be like a drug lord's mansion, I guess. Yeah. Um. There's other rumors, such as, uh, they this was like a movie set for the Thirteenth Ghost film, which maybe it, it wasn't. I mean, they kind of look similar. Um. What else? Like it was the whole '80s thing or whatever. Right. Was built. Yeah, right. Yeah. So th this mansion was built around the '80s and early '90s, and it got abandoned probably in the early 2000s. The guy went bankrupt, or right. something like that. Didn't have enough money to maintain the place, and just had to be abandoned. But let's begin the adventure, guys. It's starting to rain, but before we do, smash a thumbs up. It's coming down. Trying to pour. Oh my god, <laughs> Bro, it's pouring. We are getting wet for you guys, so definitely make sure to smash the thumbs up button for this. this. View, yeah, this is an incredible view. Awesome. This is what I mean, guys. Like, everything is so overgrown, and we're in the middle of nowhere right now. It's insane. Wow. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's raining hard. Yeah, it is. <laughs> oh my god. How's the, how's the leaves? Is it... I'm getting some good cover on it. Yeah, it's holding it's your head under it. <laughs> Bro, look how big it is, though. I know, dude. Oh my it's gosh. Huge. It's all glass. The view. Dude, all dude, glass. Just, imagine the view. It looks like that's wood down there. That's just boarded up windows. Like, even oh, the yeah, bottom you're is right. That's so cool. Drone shots are going to look sick. Oh, yeah, for sure. Once this rain stops. Go ahead and jump into it. All right, we've been sitting under these, this tree for about five minutes now, just looking at this beautiful abandoned glass mansion. Oh, I mean, look at that. That looks spectacular. But we cannot be just sitting here and waiting for the rain to go away. As I said that, the rain it got a little bit harder. <laughs> it got harder, bro. It's picking up. Are you just sending it? I'm sending it. <laughs> look at Steve. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
there's a path right here. I think some car must have came through. Now let's take a closer look. Oh man, it's super drenched now. Guys, I think what I'm gonna do is make my way from the front to the back side of this abandoned mansion. So right now, check this out. I'm right next to the garage. It's made of wood. That's dope, it used to hold three vehicles, I guess. Oh, I can just imagine how many ticks are here. Definitely gotta check myself out right after this exploration. I'm wearing shorts too. I actually like how we're exploring this in the rain. Gives it a cool vibe. It doesn't look like a way in. It's all boarded up. But man, like... This is beautiful. I've never seen anything like this, ever. You're not really getting a lot of privacy living here. Actually, yeah, you are, because you're in the middle of nowhere. I would actually love to live here. I can just imagine how much, like, natural light just shines through this building. I had a beautiful yard. Everything looks boarded up here too. Stayed under here. Yeah, no <laughs> seriously, we 100% should have stayed under here. <laughs> yeah. Camera's soaking wet now. <sighs> Steve, you are really wet. Yeah, I'm completely <laughs> soaked. Man, I hate how it's boarded up. I really want to get in. Yeah, hopefully there's a way in. Someone made their own little way in here and then they boarded it up. Yeah, someone smashed through the glass. We're not about that though. We're just trying to find an opening. Someone, maybe like some... An easy passage. Yeah, an easy passage that maybe like a previous explorer went through. Are these ant holes? Yeah, there's a lot of ant holes. I think the rain stopped. Oh my gosh, yes guys, the rain is stopping. I was so worried, I was worried that we couldn't fly the drone, but I think now we have the chance to. Dude, come here now. What the hell? What? Bro, look down. Oh my god! What the hell? Is that an animal bone? It has to be. I hope so. It has to be an animal bone. Where's the rest of it though? Yeah, where is the rest of it? That's the scariest part. What the fuck? Should we be here right now? That might be a sign. It could be a sign, dude. First the rain, now the bones? Like I said, there's not much, not, there's nothing known about this place or why it could be abandoned. Something bad could happen, who knows? I'm hoping those are just animal bones and not like human bones, honestly. You never know, we're in the middle of nowhere. People can just hide bodies here. Way. still no sign of an entrance. I'm gonna try to get up there where Kyle is. Huh. There's a vent right there. Makes me think if there's like rooms underground too.
That's a huge radar. That's actually really beautiful. There's some flowers I can see growing around there. No ticks. We're gonna get a good view from the inside from there. So on the side of the mansion, you have the the roof covered in grass. Pretty cool. But I don't know why they would do that. Usually that's for like camouflaging. Maybe they want it to stay hidden. Gonna be a little bit careful. Yeah. Be a little bit careful on this. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's pretty. So just watch where you're stepping, obviously. Okay. Not only that, but it's really slippery because of the rain. Wow. Oh my gosh. This is so cool. Yo, there's a hawk. The hawk's right there. Guys, literally, it's an indoor pool. I was trying to figure out what that was. That's an indoor pool down there, if you guys can see. No way. It's hard to. Oh, well. yeah. Okay. Now yeah, guys, it's hard to tell. It's hard to tell, but I don't know if you can see right there. Oh yeah, it definitely looks like an indoor pool. You can see the the pool ladder right there, almost. Place, though. Dude, it's it's amazing. <laughs> it is right. The back side of the house is way cooler just because of all like the glass, but the front is too. If yeah. you didn't see the butterfly staircase uh, staircase yet, oh, I, I cool. saw it through a distance, but haven't yeah. gone close up. People can just come walk out from yeah. here too. Yeah. Uh huh. Look at that. That's a valley right there that they had. So sad to think that. This probably was never in use. They probably were building the place and moments before completion, they abandoned it because there's literally nothing inside. Ah, oh, this is incredible. You got all the privacy you need too. <laughs> literally five minutes ago, it was cloudy, it was rainy. Now it's the sun is shining, there's blue skies everywhere. This place looks great. Yeah, d dive in. <laughs> that is cool though. Yeah. This house is so odd compared to like a lot of other houses I've ever explored. Right. I mean, we're standing on a roof that's filled with gra gla grass uh -huh. next to an indoor pool. Like, yeah. Technically, if this wasn't here, you could dive into the pool. Dude, I would have done that. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's just so weird. Yeah. It's really odd. Very. You can just tell how like old it is. It's such an old attempt at like a modern house, you know? Mm -hmm. Now when you see a new modern house, it's just way different looking than this. Plus it's made out of wood, which was kind of odd, right? Yeah. Like it's wood and glass. I don't know. I wonder what kind of wood it's made of. Yeah, I have no clue. The shape and the design of it all is pretty the neat too. Cool. Yeah. yeah. It's real symmetrical on each side. Yeah. But if you kind of saw the front, which I'm sure, I'm not sure if you shown yet, when you go over, like the front's kind of almost like boring. Like, is don't it? get me wrong, it's a sick house. But, like, <laughs> the front is, it's just like this. It's all wood, and then, like, the front door with a little glass section. Right. Well, it looks pretty plain. It, the backside yeah. is definitely the coolest. After seeing the, I saw the backside first. Yeah. And then once I saw the backside, I was like, oh, my God, I can't wait to go see the front side. And yeah, then yeah. it was, like, a quarter of this right. with, like, all this glass. Right. But, like, the land, like, that's what I was telling them. Like, imagine waking up each day with, I know. Like, a morning cup of coffee and looking out over this view. Oh. I mean, that's, like, 30 acres. I was telling Colin this uh this is gonna be the YouTube house. Yeah, oh my god, how sick would that be? <laughs> Imagine we were out here every day. Yeah. We should get in a we should buy an abandoned house and all the abandoned YouTubers live in it. It's not a bad idea. Or a haunted house. 
Also, side note, <laughs> how crazy is it that it was pouring rain and now it's like burning heat? <laughs> you getting like, a tan. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know if gingers get tan, <laughs> but <laughs> guys, leave a comment down below if you would want this to be the YouTube house. I've been wanting a YouTube house. I don't know. It's just an idea to throw up. It's gonna happen. Yeah. It's gonna check the front this was actually their driveway it's a runabout wow so this is the front it looks pretty plain and boring don't you guys think the backside is definitely the top thing to see here but I do love how symmetrical this glass looks and it's very unique. Let's take a look inside. Let's take a peek. Look at that. Oh, look at that stairway. It's beautiful. It's really empty. Just made it to the other side. We're on top of the garage right now. Right? You know, there's vents that I saw over there. And it makes me think that there must be rooms underground. Yeah, very well. I, I really think so because there's vents on the on the on the valley. Yeah, I think so. Who knows, this place could probably be bigger than it looks right now if it's if there's rooms underground. We got Kyle McGrand flying the drone. I'll probably fly mine next. Little drone action? Yeah. Your foot's wet now? Yeah, my feet are soaking wet right now. My jeans are soaked. Dude, this doesn't look like it, but these are like waterproof. Really? Yeah, they're like Gore-Tex. And so like they don't my feet don't get wet. Oh dude, I have a Pick up a pair of them. Yeah, dude, you gotta get them. I always tell my <laughs> exploring Adidas, no friends. Way. Yeah, nah. Get, the wrong Adidas. Gotta get Gore-Tex with them, bro. Gore-Tex. <laughs> All right. So we just made it back to the front of the building. It honestly feels like another day. Like 30 minutes ago or an hour ago, like things were l looking terrible. <laughs> but I swear to God that we've just been here for like an hour just admiring this place. Wow. Yeah. So what do you guys think of it? Leave a comment down below. Honestly, it does really remind me of the mansion used in the 13th Ghost. If you haven't seen that movie, go check it out. It's pretty good. But like, the mansion was also made of glass, but it would always switch up during like a certain hour. It's a crazy movie. Not only that, but yeah, this architecture is just mind-blowing to me. I never thought I'd be exploring a mansion left abandoned like this ever in my life. But it makes me wonder like during the summer it must get so hot inside there seeing that it's like almost everything is made out of glass i really hope you guys have been enjoying the video so far if you have do smash the thumbs up button right now let's get this video to over 500 thumbs up right now during the premiere let's get it I wear a size 11 that was bigger than my shoe. So we just showed Kyle the bones? Yeah. And man, like, yeah. Those, I don't know, man. Like, you know, online, I heard 
that this used to be a drug lord's mansion, and yeah, that's that what I, heard. I also heard that they did like find a body here. I'm not even joking. So that could probably be a reason this, why it's abandoned. Yeah, <laughs> yeah like that the guy got so the hard. guy got arrested. That's what that's what they said. I like. Well, that's horrible. Our, our this looks online. like a. Uh, that's like. This looks like a four. It has to, it, that's like a deer, right? I don't, I don't know. I, I hope to God it's no. a deer. Dude, I hope it's a deer. Seriously, though, but that's like, actually really. But think about like where where's the other part of the bones? Like yeah, well, that, but that's where's not where's that. the other bones? If it was a deer, you would, the yeah, whole, the whole part. body would be right here. Right. You'd imagine. That's creepy, isn't it? I that's really creepy. <laughs> I have like goosebumps. That's really just came across the body. I can't that's believe that. If it was a good place to do it. It would be out here. I know. Out that's why I said. That's why I said. We, we. I'm not even getting signal really out yeah, here. Yeah, I know. That's why we were just talking about it. Did you find anything else like with this anywhere? No, around? that was that was just it. Yeah, this is my right first here. time seeing it too. I didn't even I skipped over this part. Crazy. I wish I could climb like kind of climb up. I saw inside of my drone, but yeah, it doesn't it. seem like it. Anyway, if any one of you guys know what kind of bone this belongs to, leave a comment down below. Like. Oh my god, rest in peace to whatever it was, honestly. And, and dude, the, the 13th Ghost movie was exactly like yeah, that. Yeah, just looks just like this. Right? Yeah, exactly That's like it. That's what I saw everybody saying. Have you seen it? Like, like actually, have you seen the movie or whatever? Oh yeah, I've seen the movie. Yeah. It's a good movie, Does not gonna look lie. actually like this? Kind of, yeah. Yeah, a little bit. I mean, it's a glass mansion, right? Yeah. Jeez. The only difference is that in the 13th Ghost, the mansion would like shift forms. It would change during like a certain hour. Oh. And this, yeah, this That's doesn't, yeah, this yeah. doesn't do it. <laughs> Turns out this house doesn't shift. Shoes. Yeah. <laughs> do you see a body in there? No, no body. Okay. No body. Also, with the whole like how, first of all, we drive five hours, we get all the way out here, and then we take what another like thirty minute road of like a dark like rock path like pebble road yeah and then it's we sketchy. find a random gate go through the gate this driveway is like two miles long yeah. through overgrown great like we're so tucked away back here it's it's actually wild where is the door right here can't open it i don't think we're getting in at all there's no way and you know me guys i never break into places so yeah that's gonna have to be skit but I am going to fly the drone and try to kind of zoom in through the glass to see how everything looks like. everyone thank you so much for watching this video and making it towards the end amazing amazing place we're gonna be heading out now we pretty much explored the entire mansion uh, I know unfortunately we couldn't get inside but as you saw this place is just made of glass and we just happened to just fly the drone right next to the the glass to be able to see the inside and it's, it's empty there's yeah. nothing inside yeah. We pretty much saw the inside without seeing the inside. Yeah. Pretty much. Well, mind blown. Uh, this place kind of gave me the creeps with the bones. Yeah, but, uh, with, the yeah. Bones, <laughs> with the bones. I'm, I'm, I'm like 8% sure they're like animal bones, hopefully. Anyway, <laughs> boom. I want you guys to also check out these uh, guys' channels, Colin McGran. And we got Colin Patterson. The links will be down in the description. We took amazing videos, footages, photos. Links down in the description. You want to check out all of our stuff. Um, we're gonna be exploring again tomorrow, so I'm gonna be with this guy, these guys for uh, a few more days, hitting up a bunch of cool places that I'll be putting out uh, next week. Yeah. So stay tuned for more awesome adventures. Peace. Boom. Boom.